What's up, everybody? GoPro Unboxing coming to you again with the finale to the Road to Glory John Cena. This is the Flash event. This is the final one for the John Cena card. The next event will be PCC featuring Triple H versus Roman Reigns. I have no interest in. Maybe if the undercards are somewhat decent, but I'm under a very strict uh, match limit right now. I was even unsure if I was even going to go for this. Fortunately, I did have enough because they did nerf it down so many matches, I was able to get into it. So I am on the final match right now. I was able to do 10s all the way until about 120, I believe it was, and then I did 6s. So with that being said, let's get in here and go ahead and get this Juan Cena. I did, unfortunately go way overboard with uh, title matches because I did not realize how many were going to drop in the event. It's like every freaking reset was a title. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't understand. But that's how it is. And excuse my voice as it is right now. I am kind of feeling sick. I've been under the weather the last day or two. And it's finally starting to catch up to me. Alright, tag team match with the only two that I got. That's a win. I was really surprised with the with the lower um, point value that you needed that the wall didn't come sooner. It seemed like the wall wasn't in the right place, to be honest. It just didn't seem quite right. I figured, you know... It had been a lot sooner on the on the John Cena card, and you notice I do have my new pro Finn Balor. I was able to level him up during the RTG, so that's great. He's still getting his games played, so but he's not that big of a concern because I know he's not a uh, top tier guy or anything like that. <clears throat> but after this uh, after this match, I'll have two new pros that I'll be able to start leveling up, which is the survivor Nikki Bella and of course the John Cena. And we got a speed match. And Warrior beat me. I am still leveling up my Undertaker that I got. I have not uh I finished him. He's still quite a ways away to go. Lost that one. Uh, should win this one? No. Uh oh. I may actually lose this. Let's see. Uh, it didn't give me a great uh, hand. So that's a loss. Uh, let's see. That's going to have to be a loss. <coughs> Unless these are two singles. Oh, it's going to be a tag team. Alright, well, oh, that didn't work. Let's get in here and uh, play another match. I really can't afford <laughs> to lose any more matches, but I want to get them on this one. So how are y'all doing in y'all's uh, uh, Road to Glory? Or have you finished it? Have you even decided if you wanted to go for it with it being toward the end of the tier? Is it even something that you want to waste your time on? Because, you know, frankly, this card is going to be a great card. However, it's not going to be a, uh, a long-lasting card for your Survivor tier. Because <coughs> uh, WrestleMania tier should be kicking off here very soon. 
more than likely right after the PCC match. Which is another reason why I have absolutely no intention on trying to go for the top evo uh, rewards in that. See, this isn't going good either. Uh, that's a win at least. Uh, that's a win. That definitely should be a win. Alright, now we're getting back on track. Uh, his warrior's gonna beat me though. Shit. <coughs> I, I need some more of my event pros to come up. It's uh, kind of ridiculous. That's gonna be a loss. A tag team match. May still be able to pull that out. Yeah. Let's see. Just, um, let's go with Warrior. Of course, he's going to have all of his uh, event pros now toward the end. Maybe it'll win that one. Yeah. All right. All right. So, damn. <laughs> Another loss. Let me, um, I think I'll put back in at least the legendary pros that I have. That way it's the full team that should be in there. Maybe that'll help out with a little bit of the, the losses that I'm having. Autofill. Let's change these back up. Always got to use your uh, deck modifiers, your managers. Alright. Now let's try a six and see if we have any better luck. I haven't updated the uh, picture over here, I just haven't had the time to do it yet. But I'm also kind of waiting until I have the uh, Nikki in there and the John Cena. And then I can add in all those together. Alright. Start off with our Rock. Power Charisma. I think these last... Uh, couple ones have really just been down to the luck of not having any of my event cards or very few of them alright yeah cause this one's starting off a whole lot better that's a loss of course alright Looks like we lost that one, yeah, because of his proc. All right. That should be a win, because we tag together. Definitely got him on the speed, but it looks like he had... Or was that match even a speed match? I don't know. I don't think I was paying enough attention to it. I'm going to go ahead and throw in Triple H on this one. Sacrifice the loss just in case the next one's a tag match. Yeah. That sh that's a win right there. Alright. So that should be the, uh, <coughs> should be it to get the John Cena card. Oh, no, we got one more round. Uh, we're up six to four. Tag team match. That's a loss. All right. I need to win this.
this one. Nope. Oh, it all comes down to the beak. Son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, man. I know I could have played the twos and been done with this by now. But I really thought I would have had this. Alright. Let's play one more at six, and if that doesn't work, then I'm going to go down to the twos. Because the last match that I had as a six that I won, I won pretty easily. I didn't think it would be that big of a jump from that match to these matches. But hey, I could be wrong, you know. But then again, like I said, it's all about the luck, you know. If Maybe if I got more of a... Uh, uh, the event cards, or, you know, whatever. Alright, let's throw that rock in there, which is a speed match, so I'm probably going to lose anyways. Uh, yeah. speed match <coughs> two cards that are not known for speed mm -hmm. alright there we go evening up a little bit let's go with Baylor and Sean and that's going to be a loss Oh, wait, we pulled it out. Rusev. <coughs> that was another power match, wasn't it? Yeah. All right, round three. We're up by one. Uh, let's go. Man. I am not having any kind of luck. And of course, it's going to be a tag that way, but at least it's only a single survivor. All right, down to the last one again. All right, so we got two tag teams that we can use. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and throw the event. Kalisto. Tag team Neville and Seamus. Why haven't they. Why didn't they make Sh Neville a heel? Put him in the League of Nations. Sure would have been better than what he was doing before he got hurt. Oh well. Finally, that is a victory, and I get my Juan Cena. Or as you see in the. Uh, thumbnail my uh Cena Bella or Nick or John Bella Nikki Cena I don't know how do you want to bet that I get a uh, title match pull on this final one somewhere oh, maybe not Either way, John Cena is com is finished. Now let me show you why I've been under such a stress on how much I could actually play, and even if I was going to go toward this, I am very, very close to my thirty thousand reward pool, and at thirty thousand is your last ladder. You get nothing else after that. I'm at twenty nine eight fifty one. That remaining that I have is what I'm going to be using during PCC for the undercard to try to level up th my uh, Nikki Bella and my John Cena, get them proed up, get them ready for WrestleMania tier. Basically, I'm done playing until the PCC. 
I do have a King of the Ring that finished, but I'm not going to claim it <clears throat> because if WrestleMania is coming, since I'm not playing right now because I don't want to, you know, go over and I can't get my energies or anything like that, I bowed out. And about game 30, I, I told them, I was like, look, you know, I'm way too close. I, I'm, I'm not going to energize anymore, and I didn't. And I still made it to the brackets, but that's fine. The funny thing is, is I lost this guy right here, Sidney Jones. And, you know, we went back and forth, I believe, in our, our matches. However, <laughs> the first place person lost to a bot. They did not heal. They forgot to heal or whatever. So they lost. And after game one of me losing, I was still watching the games. So I was like, maybe I should go ahead and heal up, take the risk, go on and try to beat uh, Sydney and go on to the next round. That way I face a bot and go on to the finals. I definitely should have because the bot beat the human. <laughs> That's right, a bot went to the finals. He did lose in the finals, but congrats to Jaguar for uh, securing that win. I'm sure that was one of the easiest victories you've had. But it's just kind of crazy because you can't take these bots for granted and you know I know I could have beat Sydney I did have a better deck than he did it was just all a matter of where your cards would have fell but the bot destroyed him <laughs> it's pretty it's pretty funny actually I'm sorry but so I'm not gonna claim that reward just for the fact whenever it kicks over into Wrestlemania that'll actually be a survivor card anyways so I have no reason to claim it right now for a legendary card. I'm not doing anything else. So so that's actually it for today. I do want to say uh, thank you to Blade78911 for nominating me in Biggie Dude's latest videos for the YouTube Creator shoutouts. I have already won one of his shoutout videos. Uh, this was another one for uh, viewers under... Uh, I think 5,000 subscribers, uh, content creators under 5,000 subscribers, and Blade nominated me and Mega Drew. We were both previously in a King of the Ring with him, and uh, I just want to say thank you, Blade, for doing the shout out. Thank you, Biggie Dude, and thank you, Mega Drew, because with uh, Mega Drew and Biggie Dude shout outs, I've gotten very close to that 100 subs. If you've been following me for a while, I've been trying to get to 100 subs for a couple months now because that's that's kind of my first goal was 100 subs because then you can change your URL and it's not youtube.com slash a bunch of letters and numbers. I can actually change it to go for unboxing or you know whatever I plan on changing it to. So thank you for giving me that uh, extra shout out, the extra biggie doo bump as they used to call it back in the day whenever he first started doing it. So make sure you follow me on Twitter go for 75 again I'm sorry for the voice I'm getting sick and everything so follow me on Twitter go for 75 until next time <laughs>